Hello guys, today I'm going to show you how to connect your Excel to Crypto APIs market data to get cryptocurrencies live prices. So first you'd have to register at Crypto APIs. Since I'm already registered, I'll just go ahead and sign in. From here, I'll just sign in to Crypto APIs dashboard. And once I'm done, I'll go to Excel. So I'm using Excel 2016 and in order to get the data from Crypto APIs uh, market data, I'll go to data from their new query and from there I'll click from web. So now Excel would ask me to provide the URL where it is going to get the data from. I've got two options, basic and advanced. So since I'll have to authenticate with the uh, API key, I'll click on advanced. And now I'll have to provide the URL for, for Excel where it's going to be getting the data from. I'll have to go back to Crypto API's website and I'll have to go to API Docs to get the, the link or the URL. I'll go to REST APIs. From there, I'll go to Crypto Market Data APIs. And there, I'll have to go to Metadata. For metadata, I'll click on list all assets. Once I'm here, I'm going to be looking for the sample data here and I'll need this URL. So I'll just copy this URL and I'll go back to Excel and copy this link here. Um, something else that you might want to do is Let's say uh, those APIs allow you to filter between uh, fiat and crypto. Uh, and I would like to use crypto for our example. So I'll just copy this one, go back here and click type crypto. This would uh, list only crypto assets uh, when I get the data. Something else that uh, I like to do as well is to set a limit on how many uh, assets I would like to get. So set the limit to 6,000. Once I'm done, next thing I'll have to do is provide the uh, header parameters, uh, which you can do from here in Excel. And you'd have to choose content type. Once you, you do choose content type, you go back to the Crypto API documentation to see exactly what you have to input. And you have to input that your, your content type is application JSON. I copy paste this one here and then I add another header here. I'll have to provide my authentication, which are my API keys. So I keep copy X API key from here from the documentation, go back to Excel and put that here. Next step that I'll have to do is go back to my crypto API dashboard and from there go to API keys. Once I'm here, I'll create a new API key called uh, Crypto APIs Market Data. Create new API key. And once this is created, I would copy this API key and go back to Excel where I'm gonna input my API key. Once I'm, I'm done with it, press OK. And Excel is now fetching the data from Crypto APIs. Now Crypto API says return the data that I want and I've got the record and list. Then I'll press on list and I get the data in a list format and I'll have to transform that into table. You click on transform and then click to table. You just, you can just okay this one. Once you press okay, uh, you'd have to press on this little button here and it would show you all the records in that list. I'll just untick this one, use original column name as prefix and then press OK. Once I do this, I will get the data from cryptocurrency data from crypto APIs. You've got uh, all the cryptocurrencies listed here. 
and you've got the asset ID, symbol, name, slug, you've got supply, market cap, current price, as you can see right now, volume change, one hour change, and a few other things that you can use for, for your uh, table. Uh, once you do this, you can just click file and close and load. Once you do this, uh, the data would be put into your Excel sheet in, in this format and you'll be able to, to use that. Um, once I'm done with this, I also go to uh, Crypt API's dashboard and to check if my request was successful uh, and how many credits I've spent. You just click on successful request and you'll be able to see your requests. Yep, it is successful. So from here on, you'd be able to use that data to create a portfolio, to see how is your portfolio changing and all kind of useful data you can use that uh, for your Excel sheet. Thanks for watching.